hi everyone welcome or welcome back to the channel in today's tutorial i will walk you through how to use facebook audience insights that is a powerful tool inside meta's business suit that helps you understand your target audience better before running ads or creating any content so make sure that you watch this video till the very end so that you don't miss any of the important steps if you don't have a meta business account yet you can use my affiliate link in the description i will get a small commission at no extra cost to you and you might also get some rewards or discounts depending on your plan so without further delay let's get straight into it first of all you need to open your web browser and here in the search bar you need to first of all search for facebook.com now once you are on facebook you will have to simply login into your account it should be that account on which you have a lot of pages or the page on which you are targeting the audience then you need to open a new tab and search for business.facebook.com now whichever account you have logged in with on facebook.com will have to use uh, that same account in order to log in into your business.facebook.com account over here you can give your portfolio a name like i have given it over here now your dashboard will look something like this here in order to get access to the further options you need to hover over to the left hand section and click on these three lines in the top right hand corner over here you will see the list of all of the tools that are provided to you by meta business suit so among the given options we need to work with insights so here in analyze and report you will find the insights tool so once you click on it it will redirect you on this page where you will be able to see the insight of all of your pages that includes your weekly plan your performance the reach of your page interactions follows etc you will also see a recent content page where you can basically just take a look at your post and your recent content that you have posted on your page now here in the left hand section you can see the fourth tab of audience so you need to simply click on the audience tab and this is where you will find facebook's updated audience insight tools over here you will see two different tabs the first would be the current audience and this is for the people who already engaging with your content or your page the second would be potential audience and this particular tab is to research and discover the new audience segments for the advertisements so here we are going to be exploring both of these sections so first of all you need to come on demographics so here you can also find the current audience tab or demographics so you can basically view demographic data about the people who follow you or and your page on facebook or your instagram profile so here as you can see we have uh, the list of all of your followers that you have on your page then we have the age and the gender breakdown you will also see the people uh, top cities and the top countries you will also find the information about the top languages and their engagement behavior so basically you will see the insight of all of your currently active followers here so this data actually helps you to know who you are already reaching for example if most of your audience is women aged 24 to 34 from india you might tailor your future posts or your ads for that specific demographic you can use this information to further refine your brand's tone to choose posting times and to understand the content preferences by the location now you need to click on the potential audience tab and this is where things get really interesting over here you can basically build your custom audience profiles based on the filters like location age gender interests device usage relationship status and job titles over here you will see your estimated audience size the pie chart over here some other types of charts here top cities the top countries and further details so in order to filter it out further you need to click on the filter option here in the top right hand corner of the screen and here you can type the location 
and then you can select the age here select the gender the interest and the language and you can create your own audience so here you can basically just break down uh, the top countries the page likes and the interests graphics demographics device platforms whether it is android ios or desktop for example if you are launching a skincare brand for the young woman you can target the woman aged 18 to 34 so here in the age you need to simply type 18 and after that you need to select 34 over here in the gender select women and as you can see everything is changing in the left hand section now the interest should be in the skincare wellness and beauty so here you can type the keywords like skincare and then you can press enter over here for languages it should be english and uh, you need to select english all and it will come all of your audience now click on the create audience option provide your audience name and then click on the save audience option now your data will be saved something like this which you can then click on the export option and export in the form of png csv and as pdf so once you have built a strong audience segment in the potential audience you can just save it for later or you can also simply click on the save audience option as i have showed you before and you can just name it like skincare female and then uh, next time when you create a facebook or the instagram ad you will be able to choose this saved audience during the targeting step so this actually saves you time and ensures that your ads reach the right people you can also create multiple segments and you can compare them to see which has the best mix of size interests and engagement now i would like to give you some of the pro tips that you can use in order to basically utilize this particular section effectively so first of all you need to revisit your audience insights monthly to support the trend next thing that you need to do is to simply test different filters like the job titles versus the interest to refine your niche further you can also use insights not just for the advertisements but also for the content ideas and the product planning the more you use it the better you will understand what your ideal customer actually looks like and how to reach them so this is how you use facebook audience insight to find out and understand your perfect audience before spending money on advertisements so if this video helped you out give it a like subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our future videos if you have any questions or if you want help with ad targeting you can drop a comment below and i would love to help you thanks for watching this video bye